What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of WWE 2K15 My Career Mode. Uh, in the previous episode, I unfortunately, crazily, for some strange reason, unbeknownst to the world and the universe, lost to William Regal. And he retired, uh, but he put me over when he retired. He said, this kid is the future of the business. Or something like that. <laughs> something along those lines. And now we're back to... Vicky Guerrero doesn't have anything for you this week, and I'm back to doing tune-up matches. But I'm on SmackDown, so I, I guess that that's a that's a plus here. I appreciated the uh, the scripted storylines and finally have having things that weren't you know just the same thing week after week. But I was I was a little disappointed that it just ended with a with a random match with Regal, who was the toughest opponent I faced for some crazy reason. I like whooped his ass through the entire thing, and somehow he he came back and and destroyed me. So I don't get it. But life goes on, people lose, and I'm on my way to the top anyway. So it is what it is. It is what it is. In case you also missed it last uh, episode, I changed my finisher back to my original finisher, which is the zigzag, which is an amazing finisher, and I'm glad to have that one back. Oh no. Titus O'Neil, but I'm kind of mad that I'm back to fighting Titus O'Neil, except this time on SmackDown. <laughs> Not on main event, on SmackDown. I'm a SmackDown superstar now, which is awesome. On my way to Raw, but oh shit, is Titus gonna start whooping my ass now? Maybe I, maybe I just don't have it anymore. I'm gonna do one of those storylines where oh maybe I just, maybe I just can't win the big one. Got a Sami Zayn <laughs> storyline going on here. Oh, I gotta pull him away from the rope. Oh, he won't make it. He won't make it to the rope. He won't make it to the rope. He won't make it to the rope. Oh, he made it to the rope. Shit. Then, if I have to fight any of the following people anymore, Titus O'Neil, or friggin' uh, Ray, what's his name, Ray Rich, or Honda Civic, if I have to fight any of those people again, I'm shutting the game off. Crazy. They need to uh, to vary up the the opponents and the and the story here. It was it was crazy because finally out of nowhere, you know, they had the screw job with with William Regal, and then it all led to him attacking me, and then his little bitch attacked me, and. But I beat both of them, and then I faced Regal, and I somehow lost in a ridiculously tough match that I thought I would definitely win. And there was cool little scripted events and stuff, but now we're back to... Oh, you did a nice match out there. I'll let you know if we have anything lined up for you. Like, you better have something lined up for me. Do you not see that I'm the future of this company? Do you not see it? Because I see it. Titus O'Neil sees it, and he understands it right now. Because he's getting his ass whooped. Great move, I know. Hey, Titus. So good. Boom. Ooh, spinning heel kick. That was nice. Twas nice. What's my other finisher? Or not finisher, signature. I know I have two signatures. Maybe, oh, I think I have to press, like, a direction and the Y button. And that's my other signature. This is one of my signatures. Hit that charged finisher. And and just like everybody else, Titus, you will fall. I've only lost, it's, it's a good thing I've only lost, like, I guess that kind of sounds bad if I say I've only lost important matches. <laughs> like, I've only lost... Matches that that actually have some difficulty to oh my god Titus just kicked out what just happened What just happened? There's definitely some sort of increase in uh in difficulty going on here, and that's fine. I'm all for it I'm all about it. Give me a challenge, but I mean like Titus. That's a challenge Titus They reverse everything at this point in the in the story mode Everything gets reversed. All right. You're not that tired. You still have green Like go up to the top rope Oh, my stamina or whatever is low. Come on. Get that stamina recovery. Oh, and he's getting up. I'm going to let him get up. Oh, no. He's not going to. There we go. Elbow dropped to the back. Why is he taking so long? I should try to pin him now. Let's see what happens if I try to pin him. Oh, he's going to be in the ropes. Shit. I can't stand that. I got to remember to pull them out of the ropes. I keep forgetting. Keep forgetting. Drag him over here. Knee to the face. Bop. One more socket. One more hit, and it's back to signature number two. Oh, I tried to do that. Maybe, do I only have the one signature? I don't know my own damn moveset. I'm pretty sure I have two different ones. Oh, my other one is a is a top, wow. I completely forgot. My other one is a, <laughs> is a top rope signature. My bad. Come on, hit that zig. Oh, no! Did he just reverse my finisher? Like, this is a joke now. This is starting to be a joke. Because Titus O'Neil is now, uh, like, going on the offense on me. 
And this is not, this is not right. This should not be happening. I'm not about this. I'm not about this life. At too fast. Are you kidding me? Boom. Titus. Pin him. Good lord. No, don't turn him that way. Like, why would you purposely turn him towards the ropes? Ah. Uh, two and a half. Hmm. Hit to the back. Punch him in the back. Again. I need to try to make up some mitt, maybe. No. <sighs> How is Titus getting offense on me now? I can't do it. I can't do it. What? I reversed that. There's no way that was too fast. Are you kidding me? There's no way that was too fast. If I get, if I lose to Titus O'Neil, I was about to say, I better have a lot of fucking momentum there. Good lord. Reverse this. Reverse this. Mmm. Nice reversal. Pin off the reversal. Let me see. One. Two. Mmm. I cannot let him hit his finisher. I need, I need a submission here. That's what I need. Turn him over. Ah, I need to get him on his back. So I can get him with a submission. Come on now. Come on now. Here we go. Anaconda Vice. Anaconda Vice. You're going to tap out. You're going to tap out. You're going to tap out. I told you. That's right. Victory by submission. Wow. Titus on, like, that was tough. These are getting tougher. I've never faced Titus O'Neil in that capacity before. <laughs> and I don't appreciate it. Smack, I get, I'm SmackDown now, though, so I'm, it's, I'm getting to, to the big time. Whew. But at the end of the day, everyone enters the danger zone. William Regal happened to get one over on me, but it happens. But he'll never be the same. <laughs> he'll never be the same again. His life has changed forever after entering the danger zone. Oh, my God, Vicky, go away. Go away. Huh. All right, let's... um. Some attributes. Let's increase some attributes here. I have an issue with momentum. That goes down really quick. How about like recovery or damage recovery, stamina, stamina recovery is all the way up. What happens if I increase attribute cap? Hmm. I didn't know that was a thing. Well, I'm afraid I have some bad news. <laughs> oh, thirty-seven thousand VC. No, thank you. Uh, I don't want to. I don't want it that much. Momentum, strike reversal, let's go up. Grapple reversal, put that up. Aerial reversals, no one really hits me with anything aerial, so I'm not really worried about that. Stamina, let's put up. Uh, strength will go up mm, a little bit. 297, we'll use 297 for strike speed. And then movement speed. Fast, I gotta be quick. Quick and agile. What's my overall right now? 81, all right, still moving up. Another achievement, hard worker. Don't even care what it says. <laughs> I know I'm a hard worker. Mega baby face. Moving on up. Just an update. We still don't have anything to do with the uh, Same thing. Just an update in the situation. Tune up match with Ryback on SmackDown. People have asked me why I don't do dark matches. Um, I'm pretty sure dark matches also lean like lean you more towards a, a heel. And I'm just staying mega, mega baby face right now. So the tune up matches give me more um social media followers, which increases my popularity, keeps me Mega, mega, huge baby face, and holy shit, facing Ryback. Feed me more. About to feed you this ass whooping. About to feed you this ass whooping. I hope you hungry, boy. Hungry. Mmm. Like a hungry man dinner. That's what that is. Big necks, big checks. Ryback gonna get his ass beat. Great reversal. Grab him. Punch him. Oh, oh, my face. Oh, no. <laughs> my beautiful face. And boom. Right back. Free me more. Free me more. Bulldog. Hey. Big bulldog. big bulldog. That's what they call me. They call me Chris Danger, the big bulldog. Hey, ref. Suck it. Come on, right back. Hmm. Oh, shit. Oh, no. No. Uh, we still got tie ups this far into the match? That's interesting. Oh, here we go. Oh, wh wait. What am I. It started filling up and then it stopped filling up. What the fuck was that about? That was odd. That was some crazy shit. Oh, right, oh, forgot another one. Oh, man, right back. You're bad at this. If I beat you with that slow as shit one, you're not very good at this. You're even worse than me. Boom. Right back rules. No, he doesn't. He just got drop kicked in the face. 
it's kind of cool seeing Ryback's um, reemergence, I guess you could say. He went through that whole thing with Team Rybaxel, which, by the way, oh my god, I hate when tag teams just, like, squash, oh my god, squash their names together. Oh, shit. And just form some random team name. But he, he recovered from it, and now he's back, and he's in, in main events now, so good for him. Good for him. Mm. The big guy. Big guy with a little guy about to, shit. About to get pooped on, apparently. <sighs> Get up! All right. Oh no! Mm -hmm. <laughs> Miss these reversals, man. I'm trying here. Hard to time these things. Boom! Drop kick. All right. Need to get some better offense in. I'm gonna take him to the corner. Try to hit that moon salt. Oh no! Crap! Wrong one. That's okay. He has to be facing me to do the moon salt. That's fine. I'll take that. I'll take that, and I'll take this. Stop me in the face. Mmm, choke on that. Mmm, eat that. Right back. Hungry for that foot? I'll feed you more foot. That's what I'll do. Feed me more feet. Moonsault, boop. You weren't ready for it. Let's go for the cover. Let's see what we can do. One. Oh, okay, got it. One. Got my signature. And it's a, like I said last time, it's a top rope signature. So, ref, get the fuck out of my way. Here we go. Got that signature. Oh! Did I hit it? Oh, yeah, I kind of hit it. <laughs> kind of hit it. Hmm. Two off the shooting star. Oh, he couldn't get it. He couldn't get it off the shooting star. Super kick. He's not going to go down yet. I'm, gonna, I'm not going to hit my finisher yet. I don't think he's ready to, uh, to be defeated. He's still got yellow. I assume he's going to be somewhat... Tough to beat. Hmm. But I'm I'm working on him though. I'm working on him. Let's go. Oh no. Oh maybe maybe I should hit it. <laughs> maybe I should have hit it. Alright, now now's a good time to hit it. Now's a good time to hit it. Mm, kick. Um, what just happened? Why did he just fall down for no reason? <laughs> Shit! Now I can't do my uh now my fucking momentum is down. Or not my momentum, my stamina's down. Shit. Come on now. Oh, I can't go to the top rope. Get down. Get down. Abort. <laughs> Abort mission. Suck it. Hmm. Here we go. Drop kick. Ah. Oh. Recover, boy. Recover. All right. I can change to my finisher. And now we'll do a charge finisher. And that'll be a wrap. Wait, did I hit the charge finisher? No, I didn't. Shit. Ooh, that was a perfect zigzag right from behind. Right from behind. Two and three. Beautiful. Beautifully done. Right back. Add him to the list of the people who have entered the, 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 the danger zone. Oh, man. I can't even talk anymore. My voice is gone. Apparently my brain is gone, too. Good Lord. Chris Danger. The danger zone continues. Working my way up to my next pay-per-view. Going to get on Raw. Going to win the title. And apparently, I don't know. I don't want to ruin it for anybody. So I'm not going to say what happens when you win the title. Apparently something not that great happens when you win the title. But we'll save that for later. Tw I got 21,000 followers from that match. Instant classic against Ryback. I guess being on SmackDown increases the followers. That's pretty crazy. Another Vicky message, CM Punk is the WWE champion. That can get interesting as we move forward. That can get very interesting. Just an update. Oh, again, look at me doing these nothing matches to Gold Dust. Ooh, I have a chance to get my revenge on Gold Dust. If we go back in time to episode, what, maybe four or five, Gold Dust defeated me for the NXT championship. And I opted not to go for a title rematch because I was done with NXT. I was moving on up. Moving on up the chain. But now I have an opportunity to seek my revenge against Goldust, who somehow magically beat me. Because uh, in title matches, I th oh shit, I think they're a lot, people are a lot tougher to beat in title matches. And big pay-per-view main event, main, main event matches. <laughs> main event. That's a new, uh, that's a new type of match. The main event match. Main event 
Here we go, Goldust. You're getting your ass whooped now. Boop! Take that home to your pappy. The American Dream, Dusty Rhodes. <laughs> Dusty Rhodes. I'm a superstar. I'm gonna whoop your ass, Goldust. We can just get stomped on. Boom! Dropkick to the face! And, uh, so good. Don't want to tell that to Goldust, because he might take that the wrong way. Mmm. Look at that. You hear these cheers? For me, Goldust, not for you, for me. And bam! Nice. Shot to the heart, and you're to blame. I'm whipping Goldust. You silly bitch. Oh no! Oh shit. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. It's okay. Oh, son of a fuck. I gotta stop running at people. <laughs> I do that way too much. I spam the run way too much. Ah. Oh, step on my face like that? That's my money maker, boy. What are you thinking? What are you thinking? This is what I'm thinking. I'm thinking kick. 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 And kick. And one more to your face. That's what I'm thinking. Mmm. And I think I'm going to wait for you to get up. And I'm going to hit that Hurricane Rana. That's what I'm going to do. Come on, get up. Get up, Goldie. Get up. Come on. Work your way up. There he goes. There he goes. Crawl for it. Crawl for it. He's up. And what the ever-loving fuck was that? <laughs> Good lord. You know what? Let's just finish this. Oh, no, I might not finish it. He's still got a lot of uh, a lot of health left. Zigzag, boy! It's got to be. Uh, let me get him away from the rope. Pin him from there. There you go. One, two. Uh, I knew I might not be enough. Damn it. I knew it. I knew it might take something more. That's okay. That's okay. I'm fine inflicting more damage on Goldust because of what I've been through with him. No! Turn this around, boy! On your face! Alright, Anaconda Vice time. Oh no, this is the, the dragon. Oh, the dragon sleeper! Mm. There's no escape from this gold dust. Anaconda Vice, I have to stand in the in the middle of his body, not at his head. That's what that. That's what happened there. So let me hit him here. Oh no! Um, what? Yeah, you're almost gonna. <laughs> you're almost gonna get me. Almost. Oh shit! Stop. All right, let me get out. Let me get out. Let me regroup here. Shit. Mmm. What now, Gold Dust? Let me hit the Anaconda Vice out of here. Anaconda Vice out of here. Let me make you tap on the outside. I'm gonna make you tap on the outside. And he taps on the outside. Do I get anything for him tapping on the outside? I do not. Okay. So nothing happens? Okay, cool. Cool story, bro. That's that's crazy. I guess that makes sense, but I don't appreciate it. Makes sense, but I don't appreciate it. But it's okay, I'll make a tap right here. I'll make a tap right here. I'm not worried about it. Anaconda Vice, game over. Tap. Tap Goldie. Tap, 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 Peru. Yes! I got my revenge on Gold Dust. Finally. The Rhodes fit the entire Rhodes family is next. I'm coming for coming for you, Stardust. <laughs> You're next on the list. Alright. Let me guess, Vicky. Did I have a nice match? Please, Vicky, tell me I had a nice match. I'd really like to hear it. That'd be great. Make me feel so good about myself. Instant classic. 23,000 followers from that. Wow. Being on SmackDown. Oh, thank you, Vicky. Being on SmackDown definitely increases the followers like tenfold. That's crazy. <sighs> what do we got next? I'm moving on up. Moving on up. Getting ready for Raw. Oh, oh, the Rumble just happened? CM Punk defended the championship against Daniel Bryan at the Royal Rumble. I want to be in the Rumble. Just an update again. And a tune-up match versus Xavier Woods. <laughs> Uh, tune up, tune up, tune up. What are you tuning me up for? What are you tuning me up for? I should be at the top of the card right now, but I'm in a tune up with Xavier Woods. It's a new day. Apparently, they're uh, they're debuting next week on on Monday Night Raw. So that's looking forward to seeing what that's all about. What just happened? Xavier Woods, Big E, and um, Kofi Kingston debuting next week on Monday Night Raw. Apparently. Just got done watching Raw a little bit ago, actually. I should, I should do a little review while I while I do this. If I create videos on Mondays, I should do like a little 
raw review along with it. Well, I'll give you my brief raw review. It was a uh, meh, <laughs> I guess is the best way to put it. It was really cool having Daniel Bryan come back. That was a nice surprise. The authority's gone now. Uh, but aside from that, it was kind of just your your normal everyday raw. And after such an incredible pay per view, it's kind of it's kind of disappointing seeing just kind of a, a regular raw happen instead of you know a, a better follow up to such an amazing pay per view. But you know it's it there's ups and downs and and th that's all I can say about that. <laughs> there's ups and downs. So, but apparently next week the anonymous raw general manager is coming back, and that just makes me want to hurt and punch a child that's that's just that's insulting them bringing the anonymous raw general manager back that was such a dark day in wwe them having just the same shit every single week week after week after week the same crap mm. and people were not happy with that anonymous raw. it was a weird way to end the show too with just like the the announcer oh shit how was that just the general manager, like the da -da ding, da -da ding, fucking text message thing going back, going on and off. Ugh, I was not a fan of that. Kind of a weird way to end the show. Again, after you debut Sting, I feel like you kind of need a stronger follow-up Raw, in my opinion. And I don't think that was necessarily that strong. But we'll wait till next week. We got TLC coming up in a couple weeks. What I'd really like to do, I've been talking about starting that universe mode, is kind of book like book through WrestleMania kind of how I would do it in universe mode. You know what I mean? Like the way that I would like to see um the product progress between now, you know, through the Royal Rumble and to WrestleMania. I think I might do that when we start the universe mode and then like after WrestleMania we'll do some sort of other kind of uh, you know, storylines and making up original stuff. I think that that could be really cool on top of this. But first, I got to I got to take over the WWE. Zigzag boy. And I'm going to pull him. Oh, nope. Pull him towards the middle of the ring. And then I'm going to pin him. Hey, look at that. One, two, three. Xavier Woods. It's a new day for me. But for you, it's the same old story. Because you are lying on your back for the three count after the zigzag. I hope your Raw debut goes better than your SmackDown match just went, Xavier. I truly, I truly hope that for you. <laughs> All right. So let me see. This might, this, we might wrap up this episode here. Let me see. If, if I see Vicky Rowe's face, unfortunately, I'm going to wrap up this episode. What do we got? 293,000 followers? Oh, look, Vicky Guerrero. Nice match. Blah, blah, blah. Same old shit. <laughs> All right. Thank you guys for joining me in another episode of WW2K15, My Career Mode. Again, I appreciate all the support and all you guys who come back and check out all these episodes. Follow me on Twitter at I am the Dank, and I'll see you guys in the next one.